I'm your host, Lenny Sally. And I'm Ethan Plesser. And, and this, this is Around, around Cape Fear in 5 Minutes. minutes. Cape Fear Orchestra will be having their fall concert next Wednesday, October 25th at 7 p.m. in the auditorium. There is no entrance fee, so please come out to support our or orchestra next week. The International Club is sponsoring a book and school supply drive for the students in St. Anne, Jamaica, October 16th through November 10th. Please bring your unwanted textbooks or reading books of any subject or any grade level in any school supplies to place them in the marked bins in front of the main office or in the media center. You can also bring donations to Miss Kennedy in room 106. Thank you. Now here's Jack and Taylor with Colt Sports Daily. Thanks guys. Good morning Colt Nation. I'm your host King Taylor. And I'm Jackson Elbridge. And this is Colt Sports, Sports Daily. Daily. Featuring Colt Clack. Volleyball has been named the number one seed in the 3A East bracket for the state playoffs. This means as long as they win, they will play every match at home until the state championship. They will take on Southern Durham on Saturday. Time to be determined. Soccer starts the conference tournament Monday at 7 p.m. at home with a match against Grace Creek. The boys have the number two seed in the tournament and should be able to make a run for the tournament championship. Good luck, fellas. Tennis will take on Durham High School of Arts at home on Monday in the second round of the state playoffs. Good luck, ladies. JV football had a tough one last night, losing to Southview 38-8. to My lord. The young Colts didn't have their best stuff on the field, but they should bounce back next week in their final game at home against Grace Creek. And finally, tonight, the football team takes on Southview at home for senior night. It's a pink out. Wear as much pink as you possibly can wear. Come out and show your support for the team and the seniors, and let's bring home a huge win. And that does it for Cold Sports Daily. I'm King Taylor. And I'm Jackson Elwes. And this has been Cold Sports, Sports Daily. Daily. Back to you guys. Thanks, guys. Now for a special announcement. A big happy birthday to our athletic director, Mr. Jonathan Dent. Happy birthday! Coach Dent is turning 28 years old today. If you see him, be sure to wish him a happy birthday. Attention, all FFA members will be having our annual pumpkin carving <laughs> on October 18th in the Ag Building after school. It will be $1 to, car to carve a pumpkin. Now here's Dan and Michaela with the weather. Welcome to the weather this week. Right now it is 58 degrees and foggy, so if you are going to drive a car, be careful. Um, the high is 73 and the low is 51. That's it for the weather today. Y'all have a good weekend. So did you hear Dan? Thanks, weather crew. Skills USA will be doing a canned food drop. There will be boxes placed between Mr. Casey and Ms. Morton's room and another by Ms. Wilcox's room. Please bring in canned boxes, non-perishables that are not expired to help donate to families for the holidays. This week is countdown to college week. Please go to S freak. CFNC.org. This week is countdown to college week. Please go to CFNC.org to apply to some North Carolina schools for free. We have had a college representative here during lunch every day this week. Today we have a Campbell University representative coming during all lunches. Don't forget we had the final raffle today. All you have to do is show proof you have applied to college, an acceptance letter, a scholarship letter, or show proof you visited the table during lunch to talk to one of the representatives. As always, please make sure you are checking the 12th grade Canvas page to stay in the loop. FFA will begin our fall fundraiser selling meat sticks. <laughs> <laughs> FFA will begin our fall fundraiser selling meat sticks. Meat! <laughs> Come by Mr. Metz's room starting today. Come by Mr. Metz's room to pick up your order form and sticks. You can pick up your sticks at any time before October 30th. Now here's Coach Gertz with the Friday Funny. Meat! Hey guys. Hey. Ethan, how you doing? Good, how are you? Lenny Bug, how are you? Great. Got a few good Friday funnies for us. So I drank a bottle of food coloring yesterday, Lenny. Uh -huh. I died a little on the inside. Uh -huh. Ethan, when is a door not a door? Uh, I don't know. When it's a jar. That's not funny. What? A jar. A jar? A jar. A door? Or a Me! Door? <laughs> <laughs> Few more here. <clears throat> Lenny, you should always borrow money from a pessimist. You know why? Pessimist. pessimist? Someone who sees the negative in anything. They always look on the dark side of things, not the bright side. Okay. Because they want what? Money. <laughs> <laughs>
Always borrow money from a pessimist. They won't expect it back. Oh, because they don't expect good things. Yes, you got it. Good job. <laughs> Way to go, Lainey. I'm proud of you. My shirt says optimistic. My partner left me because of my love for astrology. I should have seen the signs. That's not funny. Mm -hmm. And finally, a photo, <clears throat> excuse me, was put on trial for loitering on the wall. You don't understand, the photo pleaded. I was framed. <laughs> me! <laughs> That's it. Have a great Friday, everyone. We need to come up with funnier jokes. That does it for the announcements. This has been Around Cape Fear in 5 Minutes. I'm Lady Tally. And I'm Ethan Pluster. Thanks for stopping by. Stay classy, Colts. Remember, Colt pride is shown by doing the right thing in and out of the classroom. Make, Make it, it a, a great, great day, day Colts. Colts. Day. Hey.